and them that had gotten the victory over the beast. <laughs> Giving all praise to Yahweh Hashem Yahushua Hashem Kakodash. Anyway, this is uh, Revelation chapter 15. I'm going to read the first couple of verses. I might, may read more. And for you um, out there in Great Millstone that have been in this thing for over 10 years, well, I would say the last five years, the last two years, the last 10 years, the last almost 15 years, you really don't even have to watch this video because you know this. You know these, you know all the, um, the breakdowns, the uh, interpretations of uh, Revelation Daniel, the various prophetic books. So you really don't even have to watch this. Whether you watch it or not is up to you. This is really a cry out to uh, these other camps that don't understand this prophecy that is coming to pass right before our eyes. And I can't even speak on it because they will most likely, you know, strike me for it. So you you know what, what, what I'm talking about. You know, what I've noticed is among Jake. I'm not talking about... E well, let me start with Esau. Esau ain't having it. Esau ain't having it. They're not having... They're not dealing with any... You're, you're the biggest <clears throat> obstacle to the beast is Esau. Whether Esau knows that this is the M.O., you know what I want to say, or whether they just plain feeling it because they feel that they're free. Esau, when you go to France, when you go to Germany, you know, when you go to other European countries around the world. Oh, in Afghanistan, I noticed with this whole ordeal with uh, Afghanistan, not one Taliban member or Afghan person is, is wearing a mask. So what's that all about? But now let me talk to these knucklehead, boneheaded, two-third Negroes that come against, and they're really coming against Jake. You got Jake coming up against Jake. You have one-sided Jake pushing the thing, and, and a, a certain segment of Jake, a large segment of Jake, is something they, they 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 can't explain why they don't want to take it, but they don't want to take it. So you got clowns like Roland Martin, that big head, bucket head nigga. Get he got mad at uh he did a whole rant on a uh, Buster Rhymes because Buster Rhymes all praises to um, blessings to Buster Rhymes, you know. A uh, blessing blessings to Layla Ali. Blessings to any of you that, that that didn't take that thing. Oh my goodness! <laughs> now I'm I'm looking at the video. This this is the spirit. I'm looking at this video. I mean I'm I'm, I'm doing this video, and all of a sudden what pops up is uh, Apostle Ramlov's page, and, and look at the name, the Beast, and that's what the subject is on, the Beast. So that's the spirit. That's the spirit. Anyway, let me see where I'm going to go with this. It says, let me just read this. It says, and, then, and then at the end of the day, this is all about receiving and having victory over the beast. And how do you have victory over the beast? You don't take a big, gigantic sword and stab him in the heart. <clears throat> you have to resist him by not taking his thing. Now, we didn't went through all kinds of scriptures, man. If you go to all the GMS videos, the million and one GMS videos that have been putting up by myself and others, like-minded individuals, like-minded men, we pretty much explain the whole book 